Hello friends, look at this question. The question is a square minus b square is equals to 21 and we have to find the values of a and b. Here you can apply the algebraic identity that is a minus b into a plus b is equals to 21. Now we have to find the factors of 21. So the factors of 21 are 1, 3, 7 and 21. So when you multiply 1 with 21, you get the answer 21. And when you multiply 3 with 7, you get the answer 21. Now we have the condition that A and B belongs to natural numbers. Now this implies that the sum of these two numbers, that is A plus B, is greater than A minus B. Right? So according to this we can say that a minus b into a plus b is equals to 1 into 21. Since a plus b is greater than a minus b, so we can say that a minus b is 1 and a plus b is equals to 21. Now considering this first condition, right? And this is the second condition, possibility. So, in the second possibility, we will be having a minus b into a plus b is equals to 3 into 7 or you can say a minus b is equals to 3 and a plus b is equals to 7, right? Now, find, for finding the values of a and b, now we have systems of equation in which there are two equations are given and we have two variables. Here, we can apply the elimination method to find out the values of a and b and how the elimination is method is applied for example this call is as 1 and this is as 2 just add them up so by adding you get here 2a is equals to 22. Now, further, you can say that 2a is equals to 22. Now, we we'll just divide by 2 on both sides. So, this 2, this 2 gets cancelled. This is 2 and this is 11 times. So, we get the value a is equals to 11, right? Now, for finding b, we have to find the value of b now. Now, as you know that a minus b is equals to 1. So, putting the value of a here. So, you have a is 11 minus b is equals to 1. Further, you can say that b is equals to 11 minus 1. Or you can say b is equals to 10. So, we have a and b is equals to 11 and 10 right now we have a second case in the second case we have a minus b is equals to 3 and a plus b is equals to 7 so we are going to solve this a minus b is equals to 3 and a plus b is equals to 7 again we have two equations so we are going to apply here the elimination method to solve this two linear equations. So just we are going to add them up. So we get here 2a is equals to 10 or now divide by 2 on both sides. This 2, this 2 gets cancelled. So we can say a is equals to 5. Now we are going to calculate b. So calculating b, we have a minus b is equals to 3. So putting the value a 5, b is equals to, sorry, a has a value 5 minus b is equals to c. So or you can say b is equals to 5 minus c or b has a value 2. So from the second case, we get a and b is equals to 5 comma 2. 
Now we are going to verify whether our solutions are correct or incorrect. The question is a square minus b square is equals to 21. Now putting the value, first of all, we calculated 11 comma 10. This is 11 square minus 10 square is equals to 27. Here we get 121 minus 100 is equals to, this is 21. Here we get 21 is equals to 21. So we can say that 11 comma 10 is one of the verified solution of this equation. Now for the second case, we have a comma b is 5 comma 2. So putting the, this equation, the values, 5 square, this is minus 2 square. We are going to check 25 and this is 4 and this also makes 21. So the second solution for this equation is 5 comma 2. So we can write that a comma b is equals to 11 comma 10 and 5 comma 2. I hope you understand it and if you like it, Kindly subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.